Albright Ann. I believe we're live. Let me see. Yep. We are, we are we're recording. What's going on, everyone? How you doing? How's your day? Bit sandwich in the building. Hope you came to play. Uh, we are here with, again, once again, with Drew Holiday. Uh, we were back streaming, uh, what was that, April, you said? Or it's been a few months? Yes. yes. Uh, but yeah, we got, we got some cool things going on. We got things going on behind the scenes, a lot behind the scenes, which everyone should be doing this year, just uh, inside, being safe and building. Um, so yeah, so let us know what's up, Drew. Hi, how you doing, everybody? I started from there. I haven't seen you uh, on the last call since April. So um, we both went underground doing things behind the scene. And um, we're going to start announcing the, um, the fruit of our labors as far as uh, what's been going on. Um, as your guest, I want to turn it to you, if I may. Yeah. I'm excited about what you did at a door over the weekend. Um, it must have been like midnight or whatever, and I, I got the link saying you're live. <laughs> so, um, <laughs> simple as that. So, I mean, can you start us off with that? Definitely, definitely. So, this past week, uh, I, I assembled the Avengers. <laughs> now, I, um, I assembled 20, 20 plus artists, like a lot of artists came together, and I was like, hey, you guys want to get together and do this event where we, it's called a Gachapon event, Gachapon 2020. It's like the machine. You put the quarter in, you turn it, gotcha, 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 and then the prize drops, pop. So you can, you essentially buy this NFT coin, you put your NFT coin in, and you'll be able to get one, two, three, maybe four, maybe five prizes. So the, I believe the NFT costs about 38, 40 bucks. Yeah. So 40 bucks to win uh, some incredible art nfts and these nfts go for 200 500 thousand dollars like i mean art's priceless but for a, a token a, a gotcha pond token you know collectors they can you as a collector i say usually you know typically you look around for art you can buy you got your budget but we're we're creating opportunity where anyone can be a collector anyone can okay. buy these coins yeah. Well, well, let me ask. I know I'm your partner, but I like to participate in that. I <laughs> this sounds good. <laughs> yeah. <I'm> so, <laughs> so I mean, so right now we uh, we we didn't allow credit cards or debit cards. You have to use MetaMask. So you can use. There's an app. There's a Trust Wallet app. We're saying get the Trust Wallet. And uh, with the Trust Wallet, you can get crypto. I think you can use your debit your debit or credit card, buy some Ethereum and go on to the link and you can buy the gotcha pond coin. So actually you can use your debit or credit card. <laughs> so through the trust wallet, um, you got MetaMask has an app and a wallet, uh, the MetaMask extension. But we're saying use trust wallet because trust wallet, you can see your collectibles, you can see your crypto and it's, right. it's a pretty good safe wallet to use on a mobile phone. Right. Um, so yeah, so that's, that's, we we released the article. We had some people retweet it. A lot of people retweet it. It's um it's showing, yeah. You you sh you show love. A lot of people show love. And be so before the event went live, I released this uh, this preamble. You know this call to art, this call to creation, and it's just saying good people come together. You know not allowing these centralized platforms to dictate an artist or a creative career. You know, you have a, a lot of top platforms out there, not going to name any names, but, you know, they're kind of trying to set the rules. And this it's just a repeated cycle, you know, in traditional places, in virtual places, someone wants to be the central authority, you know, give the, be the gate holders. So me just coming in as a uh, community mindset, say, let's all step forward and as the artists, we, right. we are the value, you know, the, the total value locked is in the, the human potential. Uh, so that's what I launched and it's going loud. It ends October 26th. Go get your coins now. If you're viewing, you may get a special airdrop. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna start just as a creator. You know, I, I am wealthy. I am abundant. I can create yeah. and give to all. Uh, so go. check me out on Twitter, Phenomenal Mark, the company Adore Org on Twitter. Uh, make sure to follow along, get in the telegram, doors open. And these creatives, 
They're here to learn, be creative with the business side as well. You know, you can, you can be artistic and create some cool things, but you got to know business too. And, and the key, you got to be sustainable. You got to be able to last 50 years, a hundred years. What foundation, what empire are you setting up? And that's, that's the, that's the focus. <laughs> okay. Sounds good. Sounds good. So I'm going to bring it back on my side here. Um, some things are happening good at the network for us as well. We, um, late September, early October, we trademarked TF Mess. Nice, nice. Yes, format. The monetization by entities on social platforms. So I'm going to start elaborating more on this because I was a little upset in March when everything shut down and was destructive. So I'm going to teach the format of how if it happens again, and even if it don't, you could just keep running business as usual. And basically, by handling your business and monetizing, all you just need after that is the logistics, which is already available. Okay. And we're keeping everything going right now, such as the Amazons and so forth. I see. So we got the trademark in, and um, early this month, October, I was contacted by the School of Engineers in Philadelphia. A co-op um, introduced itself on link LinkedIn to me. So I responded this week. And then this morning, actually, he woke me up. They sent me something and said, um, we'll be setting up. We'll be setting up this week on Zoom for a meeting and everything. So um, I'm going to keep everybody posted. And things are going well. Things are moving forward, going well to where we want to be and maneuvering in the middle of this pandemic because everything just came to a stop. And I know I had to pivot as well as yourself. But we just keep on moving, and that's what we're doing. But um, my baby right here, about ready to get engineer. So um, good times here at the network. Things are moving forward. And I'll be um, elaborating on Twitter, Drew Holiday, on the TF mess from the beginning to the end, and also on YouTube myself. So partners, good to see you again. And uh, I'm excited about what you're doing. And I saw your collage of uh, artists that you had, and um, things are going good. It took a long time you get it up there to where you're at. And I just wanted to know, like, what is the end picture of what it is that you're trying to do? Now that your vision is up, what will your end product look like when everything is, is all put together and the puzzle's complete? Yeah, well, so the beautiful thing, well, so for me, you know, back in March, uh, this has been a year and a half, almost two years now, two year long journey. And for yeah. me, it, it's always been to go virtual. <laughs> so, so COVID kind of fast tracked a lot of things in a positive way. Uh, this pandemic plan, scamdemic, <laughs> but um, things happen in a good way. And my, my thing has always been to have virtual items, virtual products. Uh, when I saw how like Udemy is online classes, those are all digital items and digital goods. So my my vision is for everyone to have virtual items and virtual goods in a marketplace uh, that you can sell your services. You can create NFTs to sell one hour of your service. You can create NFTs to do a meeting. Business cards can be NFTs. I mean, everything can be virtual items. You can stock right. up your store and your store is open 24-7 globally. Right. So, so my, my, my vision is to have a global marketplace uh, with verified, verified virtual items and yeah, and have the categories, you know, we'll have, we'll have art, we'll have gaming, we'll have sports, we'll have uh, medical, we'll have charity, you know, giving back donations. Uh, I mean, it's just, it's, 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 what should I say? Your imagination is the only limit. That's really what it is. You know, it's up to you. And, and the, the beautiful thing about this blockchain space, this cryptocurrency space, it's, it's helped me to become more innovative, to think outside the box, uh, outside the circle, <laughs> outside of the norm. So I have my developers, actually one of my developers, uh, shouts out to Nigeria. They're going through a lot of the protests and their own like civil rights, civil war. So some of my top developers are 
you know, they're at a standstill right now. So we're kind of working around around things and I'm sending them peace and love. Uh, but, you know, essentially, we definitely want to get an app out there and get an app to where you could just log in, see the things you want to buy and and buy them, you know, be be the digital Amazon. Uh, so we're, good. yeah, we're off to an amazing start and great things coming and great things happening right now. Again, go on to Twitter. I'm Phenomenal Mark. The company is Adora.org on Twitter. Retweet, join the competition. I would say secure, secure your NFT, secure a ticket. Uh, I got an article showing the percentages. If you have your Gotcha Pond NFT, you get like a 30% chance to get something great. If you got an Adour NFT and a Gotcha Pond NFT, you get like a 55% chance. Um, if you just retweet and enter, you get like a 10% chance, small chance to winning something. Uh, so just, we, wanna, we want this to be the community uh, run foundation. So join, support, your every voice is welcome. Every voice is important. Right. Um, yeah, so and the, the tagline is what would should Satoshi do? <laughs> and you know, really that's just based on what would any creative or innovative in, in, individual do? You know, not stand by and wait for the government. Just don't stand by, you know, yeah. do something, step up. Yeah. What would you do? You know, what would right. Satoshi do? <laughs> exactly. Okay, so that's where it leads me to what I'm doing. This is the first time in the two years that what I'm trying to do or what I am doing is bringing the TF mess and the integrated gamer feature card under one entity. So what I did was I had a second patent pending and I had to cancel it because of the situation and uh, what was going on. So I took the format of the second one and that's what led to the TF mess. What it is, at the end of the vision on the other side of the rainbow is going to be one global entity where the masses can run their NFTs, digital assets, digital art. But the thing about it is I don't just keep it to the crypto side. I do both fiat and crypto. So you do business in Japan where they're using Bitcoin. They'll send it to you, but you can convert it to fiat. So that's the only aspect that I'm doing different under the network than what you're doing. I'm doing the conversion with it. So all is welcome, fiat and crypto like that. The best of best worlds with business and everything. So the way Facebook connects that way, I'm trying to connect the business community under one system, one entity, where it's just an entity of business. Yes. Everybody's just doing a format where you don't need the brick and mortar. Brick and mortar was shut down anyway because of the um, COVID and everything. So everybody had to go to the way business is right now, and they may have to go back that way again. So. All you need to run this under the TF mess, as I stated before, is a phone. It's a phone in a car such as Cash App, PayPal, Visa, any exchange that does the conversion. And that's it, as simple as that. And that'll lead into the integrated gaming feature card, which hopefully be available soon, where the system can accommodate all transactions. So um, I'm trying to also get into Atlantic City and the casinos. Uh, I got to revisit that Caesars Entertainment sold a couple months ago. I was talking to public relations before that. So I got to revisit that because I like to be right there and create a virtual world where the demographics is to 18, 19, and 20 years old. That's not allowed right now. But their voice in their pockets is deep. So creating a new demographic in there called virtual world where they can do this in a setting where it's not gambling, it's skill. So that makes it different and it makes it legal to able to do this. And they're already regulated. So if I could just get in there with them and I'm going to do so, I'm, I'm going to get in there on a positive note. Uh, everything's taking time, but that's the end of what it is, is 
taking gaming and business and bring it all under the system as one. So um, that'd be what the end of the rainbow would look like for this vision with TF Mess and the integrated gamer feature card. Cool, cool. Yeah, I um, I've been looking into the banking for all act, and we're not we're not gonna go into it too deep, but okay. I know uh the the governments or different countries they're all behind the scenes. They're gonna bring forward a digital play, so pretty soon there's gonna be a shift. You know, I kind of yeah, I kind of know what it's gonna look like, but um, they're 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 wanna get getting digital wallets ready. They're letting banks uh, accept or be custody for digital uh, coins, Bitcoin, well, Ethereum. That's close to doing it, the Yuan. Isn't that the closest that's ready to be the first? To my uh, I, think, I think they launched the first test. They launched the first test. But right, with Bob and some other uh, uh, entities in, uh, uh, in their country that's supporting what they're doing with the government. Yeah, it's yeah. So I feel like everyone's going to roll out a digital play um, the digital, the dollar is going to be seen different. You know, once there's a digital dollar and what the main difference is blockchain, you know, there's, there's already, you know, we use our bank accounts, we use cash app, it's all digital, but once you tie blockchain to it, exactly, that's when it gets a whole different, uh, a whole different environment. And, and that's uh, so, the environment we've been going after for years. Yeah, so so I, I recommend any business, any individual, to just start looking into the digital space. Look into, I mean, you can look into Bitcoin, but just look at what the entire industry is uh, studying, setting up the foundation, you know, that, that infrastructure, because it's it's coming. Get ready, January, February, it's coming. Yeah. Um, yes. Cool. So I think that's that's our time. Um, I yeah I'm I'm cool I'm so glad to you know hear your updates you always text me Skype me you're like uh or signal like hey this this is the updates so it, it's cool to see you know you putting that energy in there putting an effort and you know this is it's definitely a slow and steady pace you know you got to yeah. take your time and uh, have to have the energy so you know I send you more peace love and energy keep it going. Back at you, back at you. And uh, before we get off, I applaud you again. Job well done and keep up the good work. And um, the next time you come in Philly, I got a bottle of champagne for you. <laughs> yeah, definitely. This is uh, it's just the beginning. And you're going to be traveling. Hopefully, it's not too crazy to travel next year. And you know, we're just waiting until everything clears out. But um, it's just the beginning. And I want to thank everyone for the support. You know, thanks, Unc. Uh, thank you and thank all the artists, all the creatives. Uh, I support others as well. So message me, join the Telegram. Let me know what you're building. We can work together. You know, you can't so you can't survive or succeed uh, as an island. It, it's not sustainable. <laughs> all right. Also, join me on Twitter at Drew Holiday, and um, I'll have the link going to my YouTube stuff that I'm doing with the TF mess. And um, from Drew Holiday to you. Thanks for watching. Partner, thanks for hosting me, having me as your guest. And um, to the next time, you take care, all right? All right, now, Bit7 Joe, thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe, like, and re-share. Come on, people, show some love. Thanks so much. We're going to be back. Yes. <laughs> all right, now, way to do business. Right. <laughs> Good calendar. <laughs>